Ever heard the old phrase, strike when the iron is hot? Well, it's never been hotter than now. All this month at Appalachian Wireless, you can get the Samsung GS6 or the GS6 Edge for just one penny when you send them for service. The Galaxy S6, normally $49.99, now just a penny. The Galaxy S6 Edge, normally $99.99, now just a penny. Strike now while supplies last. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. 39-year-old Mike Henry Fields, also known as Mikey Fields, could face life in prison for an alleged sexual assault, which, according to an indictment handed down this week, happened September 13th. He's accused of forcing deviant sexual intercourse on a fellow inmate during a brutal attack at the Pike County Detention Center, during which he knocked the other man unconscious. Now local officials hope Mikey Fields is on his way out of town and into the custody of the state prison system. We need to get him onto the penitentiary somewhere and ship him out of here. We don't want him here in Pike County. I'm just going to be straight up with you. Uh, it's a safety hazard for our jail uh, as far as our people. In the indictment, Fields, an inmate at the Pike Detention Center, is charged with first-degree sodomy and being a persistent felony offender in the first degree. Fields was already serving overlapping sentences for a contraband conviction in Pike County and another conviction in Virginia. Commonwealth's attorney Rick Bartley said Fields' latest infraction is very troubling given that he victimized someone in the custody of the jail. He said inmates should be safe while in custody. We expect them to serve their time, but I don't expect them to be mistreated by jail staff, by other inmates, or by anybody else. They ought to be able to go over there, safely pull their time, hopefully reflect on what's going on, get some rehabilitation, and come out a better person. But with the crimes Fields is accused of committing, local officials now consider Fields to be unfit for lodging at the Pike County Detention Center. There's people here that uh, if you don't keep him locked down and keep him in isolation after what he had done to the victim, uh, they will hurt him. I intend to go in and contact the judge as soon as this interview is over, try to get him arraigned on these charges as quickly as possible so that he can be transferred out, but the case can be progressing. And then he'll have to be brought back here whenever we ultimately conclude this case. It's my hope that in the meantime, they transfer him to a very secure, at least medium security facility because, frankly, the county jail is not designed to hold somebody that's as mean as Mike Fields. Bartley said Fields will be arraigned soon. Reporting in Pikeville for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.